Hey guys, this is Joseph from Play Tennis, and in today's video, I'm going to be showing you two of my favorite drills that I do with my students to improve their volleys, whether it be on the forehand volley or the backhand volley. The first one, very simple. Firstly, we're holding the racket with a continental grip, also known as the hammer grip. Okay, and depending on the person, some like to go more towards the eastern side. Okay, so we're all different. You gotta find what feels most comfortable for you, okay? And this drill is gonna help you decide that. So somewhere between a continental or an eastern grip, hammer or handshake. Firstly, we're gonna open the racket up to the sky. So the strings facing up and simple ball bouncing on racket drill. Once you get comfortable with this, we're gonna flip the racket back and forth like this. Forehand, backhand, forehand, backhand. Let's get really comfortable with doing that drill and controlling the ball. It's going to teach us to control that wrist, which is very important in tennis and on the volleys. The next drill, we don't need a racket. We just need the ball and we're going to practice volleying with our palm for the forehand side, like so. So you notice minimal wrist movement, more emphasis on pushing forward with my arm and my body weight, we're stepping in with the non-dominant foot or the front foot. So if you're right-handed, it's gonna be your left foot. If you're left-handed, vice versa. So how does this apply to the backhand side? Again, no need for a racket. Instead of using the palm, we're gonna use the back of our hand. That's why it's called the backhand. And think of it, again, pushing through the ball, like so. Again, minimal wrist movement, emphasis on pushing forward with the arm and your body weight stepping forward with the front foot. So once you get comfortable with both of those drills that I just showed you, the first one, bouncing the ball on the racket, then volleying with the hands, then we can really start to take the volley to the next level. Now the racket becomes an extension of my hand back to that continental or handshake grip. And if I want a more powerful volley, I'm gonna grip the racket more firmly like so. If I want more of a finesse volley, then I just have to grip the racket less tight. For example, let's say I wanna do a volley drop shot to make my opponent run to the front. Again, soft touch with the hands, nice and buttery here. Boom. Same applies to the backhand side. But of course, here we're pushing with more of a compact punching motion. Forehand is the palm, backhand is the back of the hand, pushing forward. Again, for more power, that firm grip, getting the weight moving forward. And again, if we want that nice, soft volley drop shot. Just loosen up on the grip and make them run. So that's all I got for today. Those are my two favorite drills that I use to help my students improve their volleys. Bouncing ball and racket and the using of the hands before we progress to having the racket become our hand. I hope you found the tips useful. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Stay safe.